Hey, let's talk about organizing your campaigns with labels. So your team may have lots of different campaigns. Maybe some are old you're no longer wanting to see all the time, or some are for specific clients, or maybe certain campaigns are in a state that is different from other campaigns and you want to really get your hands around that. Well, labels are just the way to do that and they're shared across all users in your team. So for instance, we have a couple different labels in this example. Um, we've added some campaigns to client ABC to show you all the campaigns with, associated with this client. Um, alternatively, we could look at maybe some of your campaigns um, need some proofing and they, you've got somebody on your team who does just that, goes through and um, proofs the messages in on these campaigns. And another thing you might be able to do is you want to do is to combine labels. So if you want to look at um, campaigns that need proofing and are for client ABC, you can use the checkbox on the labels to do that. Um, and then at any point in time, you can hit this clear filters button to just jump back out to the full list of campaigns. By default, when you come into your view, you're going to see all unlabeled campaigns. And this is really great for the inbox zero folks. Um, maybe you want this shows all the campaigns that do not have any labels. So what, it, what it's great for is maybe the very the, the active campaigns that you're working on who that you haven't been organized yet will always show by default. And then you can move these campaigns into labels as you need to. So to add labels and to manage labels for your campaigns, um, come up here and hit the plus sign to create a new label. So firm XYZ, maybe that's another uh, client that we're working with. And uh, if you need to edit a label at any point, you can just hover over it for a few for a second or so, hit the edit button and make an edit here. Another thing you can do is just remove labels altogether if you no longer need them. And doing so is not going to delete your any campaigns. It's just going to remove the organization, that label from them. And then with any given number of um, campaigns, you can check the boxes and choose add label to add a label that's missing or remove a label that's on those campaigns. And that really wraps it up for label organization. Thanks very much.